Hello, welcome to the Interop Unlock Guide for other OEM devices by the Windows 10 Mobile Group. The compatibility check is pretty straightforward. Basically, you can follow this guide to interop unlock your non-Nokia Lumia or Microsoft Lumia devices like HP Elite and Alcatel Idol. Now to preparations before heading into unlock. Download all three of these using the links in the description. First one is IU Tools. Second is the SPKGs needed for the unlock. And the third one is Interop Tools. Now, first I'm going to move the other OEM unlock folder to the root drive of my PC which is Drive C. Go ahead and do it. Then since Interop Tools is to use in phone, I will move that to the downloads folder of my phone. Finally, install IU Tools. That's all for preparations. What we have to do now is to install Interop Tools app, but before that, make sure developer mode is on to allow side loading. To check that, go to settings, and to update and security, and then to for developers. Enable it if it's already not. Then since we copied Interop Tools to Downloads folder while in preparations, go there using File Explorer. As usual, first install all the dependencies in the ARM folder. When done, get out from the dependencies folder and install the certificate. Lastly click and install the Interop Tools APPX package. Then go to the app list and wait for it to appear there. Launch the app once appeared, then proceed as the video. Make sure this device is the selected provider and then click use this provider. Once loaded, open side menu. Expand unlock section and select interop unlock. There, don't apply any toggles yet. Click on the allow the installation of NDTK on any device button. Then connect your phone to PC. If you want to monitor the installation which is yet to come, go to Settings, Update Security, then to Windows or Phone Updates. Now in your PC, you need to locate the installed IU tool executable to push the two SPKG files. Go to the location displays below. If your PC is a 32-bit one, then it will be Program Files folder instead of Program Files x86. Once you get there, Click on the address bar and type CMD and press enter, that will launch in command prompt window in that directory. Now go to the other OEM unlock folder which we placed in C drive in preparations and copy its path. Then go back to command prompt and start to type the command.
paste the copied path inside double quotes. Then recheck if the command is correct and press enter. As soon as you do that, it will push the 2SPKG to phone and you can monitor the progress in your mobile. Once it gets to 100%, the phone will automatically reboot and will do the typical upgrade process with rotating cogs. Work with PC is over now, open interop tools once the phone boots back, then go to the same interop unlock page. In there, click on the Restore Default Manufacturer button, then the app might force exit, go open the app again and go to the same Interop Unlock page. Now you can enable first and second toggles one by one. Do not enable any other toggles, doing so will affect device functionality. That's all the steps, now you have fully interop unlocked your non-Lumia device, enjoy!